Hi dancers! So today's topic is going to be about your pre-point exercises. So I got this question off of my YouTube channel and someone asked me how my students got on point and how they got stronger on point. So it's really important to remember that you have to be ready to get on point before you actually go on point shoes. I'm going to make a video about um, point shoes and whether you're ready or not. So it's really important to know if you're ready or not. You have to remember that before the age of 14, your bones aren't exactly developed or fully developed. Even after you're 25, your bones aren't actually really developed. And the only way to find out is if you go to a doctor or someone who tells you that your bones are fully developed on your feet. But um, if not, of course, you can still go on point shoes. Just make sure that your ankle flexibility is already there and your ankles and your steps are strong, your feet are strong. So here are some of the exercises that I can recommend for you. So the first exercise that my student Chrissy is going to show you is the the uh, rolling of your feet using the TheraBand. So when you when you do your point and flex exercises using the TheraBand, make sure that all your toes are separated, like like separate, not clumped in together. And when you go through the TheraBand, try to feel as if you're reaching out instead of curling your toes down. So sometimes we tend to want to think that this is point or this is point. Oh, that's gross. But actually, a point is when you're lengthening your toes like that instead of curling them down like that. Now it's really important also that when you're doing your exercises, you put one leg under your other leg so that it's not over or hyperextended. That way um, there's less tension on your Achilles tendon and there's um, more work happening in your feet. Now the next exercise is going to be your ankle flexibility exercises where you move your foot side to side using the TheraBand and this is going to help and you'll feel like um, most of it from this outer part of your foot where it will help with the strengthening of that part of your foot also. The fourth, or uh, sorry, third exercise is going to be the calf rises. Now, as you know, your feet and the muscles around it are actually connected to your calf muscles. So all of this, like there's a muscle connecting to each other, which is why it's really important to develop the strength of mm, your, your ankles and then which connects to your feet and also connects to all parts of your legs and all of that so um, this exercise I really love and I've absolutely done with even my adult dancers and it's gotten them stronger too and in fact they do this also for old people in Japan actually when they're in old aging homes they do the feet exercises with a TheraBand and they also do the, uh, the exercises uh, with the calf rises because releves actually helps develop really good arches and in steps and it's really good for people especially who are flat-footed to do this type of exercise. So you can do this exercise in turn in or a parallel foot and you can uh, do eight sets to the right and eight sets to the left. You may also do this in turn out together with a deep plie and make sure you put the TheraBand there on your heel and not hitting on your ankle which might pinch your Achilles. So do eight sets also on the right and the left. So I hope you learned something from this new video of mine and let me know what else you want to hear. Let me 
share with you that I am now a Bali Philippines new media influencer and if you have time please go check out their page and of course please subscribe to my youtube channel and follow dance by lena dancewear on instagram and dance by lena underscore so i hope you enjoyed and have a nice day bye